Good evening, this is Donna with Gifted Energies, and I'm here to do a reading for Cynthia. This is a life purpose reading, and Cynthia, thank you so much for visiting my Etsy shop, Gifted Energies, and for choosing to let me do this reading for you. It is a great honor and pleasure always to share my talents and services. Um, reading the cards, as you already probably figured out, is my passion and my life purpose. And when you follow your life purpose, things tend to get a little easier. Life seems to flow um, more directly and you're not being pulled in multiple directions. It's not a fight or a challenge and everything seems to fall into place. Um, once I embraced my own life purpose, that's what's happened for me. And I'm really living my dream now. I, I have a wonderful family, uh, a career that I love, and I get to help people. This is my calling. And through this reading, it is my intent and my hope that you find the guidance and insight to help you pursue your own passion and your own life purpose. So I'm going to begin today by shuffling the deck. We're using Dorian Virtue's Life Purpose Oracle deck. It's a beautiful deck. I just love the image on the back of the cards here. I'm going to start by shuffling just until I feel an energy shift or the cards let me know that they're ready to be read. And usually it just takes a few, a few times. When they clump together or they're sticky, I, I usually tend to shuffle a little bit more, but tonight everything feels really good and I'm just really happy to be able to do this reading for you. This is a, ah, there we go, interesting. This is a three card reading and there are multiple career choices in this deck along with guidance um, and areas of your life that you should focus on. Um, if you get more than one career ch choice in the spread that we lay out, that just means that there's more than one door open to you and that you're not stuck to one, one path. The, you have many talents and many choices. So don't feel that you're limited to anything. And always, through any reading that I do, Take what resonates with you. If it doesn't feel right, if it doesn't speak to you, no worries at all. Take what resonates with you and what feels right. Maybe later down the road it'll make more sense to you. But right now, don't feel obligated and just follow your own heart and your own passion. I'm going to go ahead and cut the deck and we'll begin. Now in this deck, I always read the cards in the upright position, as you see this one is upside down. We're going to flip it upright. There are no reverse meanings um, in these readings. So this is light and love. Your purpose is to bring divine healing light and love to this world. This tells me you're a light worker. Let me just put this over here so you can see it better. The world needs you. They the world needs your wisdom, your guidance. Something that you have to offer will make a difference in someone else's life. Um, I also feel that you may have a healing touch. So Reiki or energy healing may be a possible area to um, follow up with. I'm going to go ahead and pull the next card. And that's, oh, very interesting. Healer. You have the spiritual gift of healing and a desire to share it with others. This goes right along with this first card. Whatever you're offering, your healing touch, it's coming from heart center. And being a healer, a light worker, um, it doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to be a medical doctor, but there's all sorts of healing modalities that you can pursue. 
an intuitive healer even. Um, and, and that's what's actually coming to me at this moment, that your own intuitive gifts will help you with a career in healing. The third card that I'm drawing is environmentalist. You're an angel, an earth angel, who was born to protect, nurture, and teach about nature and the animals. So it doesn't necessarily mean that you're a human doctor either. You may do healing for the planet and the environment. Whatever career choice you, you make, whatever life purpose or path that you follow, be sure that you're passionate about what you do. This gives you an idea of what you would be good at. It gives you an area to follow up on and, you know, test the waters. See if you're interested. See if it feels right to you. Um, even working with animals, Reiki with animals, again, I just keep being drawn back to this card here. and. That heart center, that's where your passion comes from. And as long as you're passionate about what you do, you're going to give it your all. And even if you were to be a gospel singer or a musician, that musical talent can also be healing. So. Do what you love. Follow your heart. Follow your passion. Don't be afraid to test the waters and test different areas. But in this reading, it definitely shows me that you are a light worker, that you have the ability to heal and help others in need, whether they be human, animal, or nature-based. Thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to do this reading for you. I hope that it's bring, brought, excuse me, I'm getting tongue-tied tonight. I hope that it brings you the guidance that you're seeking. Please feel free to contact me with any questions. Brightest blessings and have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.